Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is noun phrase 265. The noun phrase today is the domino effect. Okay, somebody wants a screenshot, do it right now. Let's get right to it. If someone says that a certain event could cause a domino effect, uh, it means one particular event could set off or trigger a number of events, which in turn causes another event and another event and so on. Uh, this, of course, alludes to the idea of someone setting up hundreds or thousands uh, of domino blocks positioned perfectly to knock down all the successive dominoes in a series. Like you always, you've probably seen this before, they just tip over one and it hits one, hits the other, hits the other. A lot of times they have it set up so that it actually forms a beautiful picture or something like that. But that's the idea. That is the domino effect. All right, let's continue. The term the domino effect was originally a theory proposed by the United States, starting with President Eisenhower in the 1950s. The theory suggested that if one region or, or area came under the influence of communism, then the surrounding ones would soon follow like a domino effect. Uh, this theory um, then, this theory, this theory was used by a number of administrations to justify American intervention around the world. So that's how it started, but you, don't, you often hear it used today in a number of different situations. Uh, all right, well, here's a, here's a couple right here. So here's an example. Uh, many business an analysts claim that if one of the major economies around the world, uh, such as you know, the US, China, the EU, or Japan, uh, were to collapse, uh, it would set off a domino effect for the rest of the world. So really, you only need one of them to collapse, and maybe they all might start to fall down. One by one by one by one, it would probably be, they, they may be weeks apart, but one would probably, you know, because they're all so intertwined with their banking system and markets and everything else, that if any one of those major ones went, it would probably, you know, eventually knock down the other ones. Um, a small country could go and maybe not bring down the world, or smaller, but any one of those four would, could probably do it. All right, number two here. The EU often feared that if one more European country were to leave the EU, it could set off a domino effect of other countries to follow and possibly collapse the whole EU. That's one of the reasons why they don't want them to leave. Even uh, even Britain's uh, agreement was not a 100% break off. So, um, you know, but if another one were to leave or if it ever really started that way, you know, you would just need a couple to go and probably the whole thing would collapse. All right. And we have a third example here. Uh, some advisors suggest uh, people start a series of good behavior or habits and set off a positive domino effect. Well, you'd have to work on that one. That one you'd have to do on your own. But I've heard, you know, I've read articles where some people said that as well. So it could be used that way too. Anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it was clear. I hope it was very informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.